joined now by eye test we know that eye test mm -hmm. absolutely loves adores um usman dembele we know though that he does have matchsticks for hamstrings would you endorse this move to manchester united bro if you remember around june time i came on here yeah way before we was even linked to him way before there was any talk and i said get them belly instead of sancho get them belly instead of sancho this guy is better than sancho this guy is better than sancho i think we're getting a proper player and i'm, I'm excited about this deal he's automatically gonna be the best winger in the league automatically as soon as he what? comes he's gonna be the best winger in the league what? i'm telling you bro. what do you mean what what is well, first of all, he's not better than Sancho because they've both played for Dortmund. Yes, and if you ask Sancho. most Dortmund fans, they'd easily say Sancho has been better in his two seasons than Usman was. First of all, second of all, he's not, he's not Salah, he's not Mane like those are your first two. Well, so, so, so let's strip this down for a second. First of all, you're saying we're getting a proper footballer. Are you suggesting that Jaden Sancho is not a proper footballer? No, no, Sancho's a very, very good player, but Dembele is different level. Different level. What makes what makes him different different level though? Because of course, I'm gonna be really consistent with my opinions on this now. Because he's being linked with Man United. This isn't Dembele signing for a rival and I'm trying to play him down. This is potentially Dembele joining my football club that you all know I love and defend. He's different level footballer. What's he gonna produce? What is he going to produce for Man United? that Jadon Sancho can't, or, or in, in your opinion, no other winger in the league can because he's going to be the best. What is it he brings to us? Explain that to me, please, I test. He's going to bring creativity. He's going to bring unpredictability when he's on the ball. He's going to beat players. He's going to provide assists. He's going to put um, contribute to a couple goals as well. He's, I'm telling you, he's going to be a problem in a Premier League. Full backs. Oh will be scared when they see him on the sideline because the way he dribbles, I have uh, under 25, I can't think of a better dribbler than him. Okay. Under 25, he's the best dribbler in the, in the world. And I, can, yeah? and, I can, and I can accept all those things. He's two-footed. He's a good dribbler. People are going to be scared. But what is that going to deliver? What will be the re what's going to be the outputs? And I don't just mean goals and assists. How is that going to benefit Man United? What is it going to do for us? How is it going to win us games? because he's got two feet, because he's a really good dribbler. Explain. I, I, I'm not even trying to be facetious here. I, I, I want you to explain to me how this works. Like I said, he's going to bring creativity from the wing. Because, for example, Rashford and Green with their goal scorers, they're, they're not creators. It, Usman Dembele is a creator. So not only do we have creativity in the, in the midfield from Bruno and Pogba, he's going to bring more creativity from the wings. So I believe that's that's the main thing that he's going to bring. He's going to bring creativity, more creativity to the team. And he's going to draw, not, maybe not just from assists, but also because some from the eye test. Because they, when you're very good at dribbling, yeah. So your signal just broke up really bad. That I test. Say, say that again. I test. I test. Start again because you're sick. I test. I test. I test. I test. I test. Your signal went. We couldn't hear you. Say that again, please. Yeah, like when when you're very good at dribbling, yeah. You draw players in. You draw the ball. Of of. We've added Indiana to the call. Uh, I test. Is your signal better? Sorry. Yeah, yeah. Can you hear me? Yeah, that's better now. Wherever you are. Let me. Let me. I want to go back to your point you were making, but then we'll go to Indiana. What about the injury record, though? As a Man United fan, is it not a big concern to you that Dembele just cannot stay fit? You see, um, before he came to Barcelona, he's never had an injury. He's never had the injuries. Only as soon as he came to Barcelona. And a lot of people say the reason is because with, with the former manager of Alverde, yeah, mm -hmm. the training wasn't intense enough. So when these players went onto the pitch, they got injured a lot. You um, Look at their injury, um, Barcelona's injury record. I think only last season, they had, it was a crazy number. It was like over 50 injuries they had Barcelona. 
because of the manager, because he his training wasn't intense enough. So I believe that I, I need to see him under a new manager, under a new system, because um when because before he came to Barca, he never really had any injuries. It was only until he played with that manager, and we didn't get to see him on the set end. He missed he missed the whole entire um Kike set end run through injury. He hasn't played a single game under him, so. Yeah, but also mm. um, with the type of football that we play, um, I think that Dembele will get injured. If you look at Rashford, Martial got injured throughout the season. So, what makes you think Dembele coming playing in the Premier League for the first time? Um, what makes you think he's going to stay fit for the whole season? See, we don't, we we don't know. We don't know. But it's a loan deal, so there's no risk. If he if he gets injured, if it doesn't work out, he will go back. So I don't see what the de- big deal is because if it doesn't work out, it's not like we're stuck with him. We can't. Yeah. Sell him. The, 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 the one thing I would the, say the about big it. Big deal is that if it's go on, an alternative to Sancho, it, I don't listen. We're, we're trying really hard now to move players on that one aren't good enough or two injury prone, whatever the case may be. Do you really want a player coming to a more intense, fast paced league who's injury prone instead of Sancho? Makes like no said, sense at all. Like, like, like exactly. I said, it's it's just a loan deal, and it looks like we're not going to get Sancho this summer. Because it's not just a loan deal, though. You still you still it's pay it's wages. I know, but it's not, said, we, it's not listen, free. Bro, listen, bro. It looks like we're not going to get Sancho because Dortmund are asking for too much. So we need someone for this season. For this season, I'd rather get nobody. I mean, I'd rather get Dembele than nobody this season. And then if. We, so I'd rather get Dembele for a whole season. If it works out, we keep him. If it doesn't, go back in for Sancho or go back in for another winger. It's just for a season. It's just a loan. So it's not that deep. I don't think it's I don't think it's a case of like, should we go for someone else if we can't get Sancho? It's not it's not a case of that. It, it's more of a case of Dembele himself. Like I, I get I've, I've I've watched him at Dortmund. Yeah, he's great on the ball, incredible on the ball, but he's injury prone. And I think if he does come, I think they're looking at it as a loan, but not instead of Sancho. I don't think that I don't think it's either or. But listen, I think a lot of what you're saying about Dembele makes sense. The injury problems are a big concern for me. If I was to ask you this right now, um, I test. If Man United came to you, Woodwood would, would walked up to you now and said, "Yo, I test, come here, bruv. and you were, "Yes, brother." What are you saying? You went right. We can sign Dembele, or we can sign Sancho. Which of the two are you picking? One or the other, who would you pick now? Both available, both we can get. Who are you picking? You see, I'll I'll do a medical for Usman Dembele. If the medical is positive, I'll get Usman Dembele. But as of this moment, with looking at the injuries, I would get Sancho over Dembele. Okay. Only because of the injury. I'll do a medical. See how his fitness is. Because if if his fitness is good and there's it looks like the he's not going to get a future injury. There's no risk of a future injury. I'd rather get Usman Dembele. Mm. But at the moment, Sancho... 